Brazil's far-right ex-president Jair Bolsonaro risks losing his right to run for office for eight years. He goes on trial later this Thursday, accused of abuse of power and misinformation. Those charges stem from his unfounded allegations against the country's voting system. Yano Nusko reports. Bolsonaro has kept a relatively low profile since his defeat to President Lula in last year's presidential elections. However, this is a day when he's not going to be able to avoid the spotlight. That's because the Supreme Electoral Court are considering charges against him of abuse of political power and also the unlawful use of communication channels. It's a case that's been brought by the PDT political party, and they're asking judges to strip Bolsonaro of his right to stand for political office for the next eight years. It all centers on a meeting that Bolsonaro held in Brasilia last July with the ambassadors of around 40 different countries. In the meeting, he attacked Brazil's electronic voting system, claiming it to be fraudulent, but without presenting any evidence. And it also was all broadcast live on TV Brazil, which is a publicly funded channel. Now, the judges are also going to be taking into consideration a draft decree that was found at the home of Bolsonaro's former Justice and Public Security Minister, Anderson Torres. The decree would have allowed Bolsonaro to alter the results of last year's presidential elections and potentially stay in power. The judges have decided this has an unequivocal correlation to this particular case. Bolsonaro himself denies any wrongdoing, saying that he's always acted within the parameters of the Constitution. Now, we're unlikely to get a decision in this hearing today. There are three hearings, in fact, scheduled over the next week for this case, but we should get a good indication of the judge's thinking and a good indication of whether this could really spell, if not the end of Bolsonaro's political career, then certainly a long and protracted period in the political wilderness.